Hey guys, welcome to this episode of DVD Deep Dive. I am Anthony. This is Collectors Entertainment Network. And this week, we're going to look at True Calling, the complete series, which is only seasons one and two. But we're going to get into that this week on DVD Deep Dive. Hey guys, welcome back to DVD Deep Dive. Before we get into True Calling, I'm going to ask you guys, please subscribe to the channel. Please comment down below. Let me know if you watched this show and any memories you may have. Please share this video with anyone you think may like it as well. And go ahead and give this video a like because that helps a lot too. All right, True Calling. This is probably going to be a pretty quick video because there's not much to show. But I definitely wanted to touch base on this show it was a great show that got canceled way too early they had um a full first season and then they only had like five episodes of season two in fact i don't even think the finale aired in fact i think that's what it says it says it features the unaired final episode but if you're looking at this let's see let's go uh true calling the complete first season there is eliza dushku faith from the buffy the vampire slayer uh, show and of course you're going hey is that Brandon Walsh that is Jason Priestley and let me tell you guys I, I mean I haven't seen too much Jason Priestley I've seen all of 90210 because of course I'm I am the perfect age for the kids who grew up on 90210 uh, if you look back they were the class of 93 and I am the class of 95 so they were always just like those couple years ahead trust me everyone who I went to school with watched it even the guys because i mean there were guys on the show and you know pretty girls and all that stuff so even the guys watched it because it was all it was just about being in high school in the 90s but we're not here to talk about 90210 we're here to talk about true calling but my point is is that i haven't seen him in a lot of stuff besides that and this and let me tell you he is amazing in this you would think jason Priestley, i am telling you he is this is the best thing i've seen him in um, again, I haven't seen him in a lot of things, but he was just so perfect in this. Anyone who doesn't know the, um, the sort of plot of this is her name is, uh, I think it's True Davies and she works in a morgue and people that come into the morgue, it, it ends up being even, um, outside the morgue, but it starts in the morgue is that all of a sudden she's like preparing them or whatever. And then they say, help me and when that happens all of a sudden her day rewinds and she's and she's thrown back to the second she woke up that day when they're not dead and she has to figure out how to save them and once it happens a couple times she realizes that anyone who comes into the morgue not that, that this doesn't happen with everybody but once they come into the morgue she immediately starts going through their stuff to try and find anything about them which will help her when her day rewinds um but, and Zach Galifianakis is in this too. It's the first time I'd ever seen him. He's amazing. He's like the, like sort of the head of the morgue. And she's just like, she's like a med student who's doing some, you know, work at the morgue to put herself through college. But it's a great show. Here is the front. Here is the back. Let's take a look at what we've got. There looks to be a hype sticker in here. It just says six disc set loaded with extras but we will throw that back in there and here is disc one and two there is your front there is your back open it up up oh, the disc is falling out but that's all right pop it in and there are your discs now if you look here disc uh, for um, three and four, they all have the picture of Eliza Dishku the same, but the little side pictures are a little different. So there's the front. Here's the back. Let's check the discs. Oh, these are, that one's coming off too. And there you go. There's Jason Priestley. Now this guy's her brother, I think, and I think her sister was the one on the other disc, though they play a part in it as well. All right, and then here is discs five and six. Here is the front. Here is the back. 
Hey, and the discs are in the right spot. And there is Zach Galifianakis right there. He's great in this too. Uh, he's funny, but it's not as much of a straight-up comedy role. Um, but he is he is funny in it, uh, um, even at in the more serious uh, role. All right, let's look at the special features. You have selected episode commentary. You have deleted scene with optional commentary by the director, executive producer. And you've got a few featurettes. You have Finding the Calling, The Pilot, The True Path, Season 1, and Evil Comes Calling, a late screen test uh, featurettes. And then you have Somebody Help Me, music video by Full Blown Rose. Okay, those are your special features. Here is Season 1. One, we're going to put that back. And here is season two. And again, it was canceled um, just too prematurely. It was, it really was a great show. Front and back. Uh, it says right in here, two disc collector's edition. We'll do the special features first. Contains all five season two episodes. Five, you know, episodes. Plus making a feature at an unaired final episode. Does that mean it's five altogether or is it uh, five that aired plus the sixth one? Have to look at that. All right. So what do we got? This was, I believe this was a Best Buy exclusive. I mean, what I bought was a Best Buy exclusive. Includes one unaired episode and new featurette. There is your hype sticker. Let us take this out. You've got your, which was always common back then for Fox video releases. Your sort of Fox nose TV DVD, all your, you know, Fox produced TV shows in this little basically catalog. Um, I don't think you could order from it, but you uh, just letting you know what was out there. And then here is your paper. There you go. There's the front, and here is the back. Let me see what it says. Uh, it's got original air date for one, two, three, four, five, and then it says unaired. So there really is um, six full episodes because it has the unaired pilot. Then unaired, I'm uh, not unaired pilot, unaired final episode. But I don't think it was a finale. It's been a few years since I watched this. Um, I think it just sort of goes off the air, and that's it. But I'm wondering if the because the unaired final episode was called "Twas the Night Before Christmas Again." It was unaired. But if I look at the air dates for here, they start in March of 05, then, yeah, March of 05, and then April, yeah, April 05 is when it finishes. So they probably produced some episodes, probably produced the six episodes, and then they probably had, you know, but they basically canceled it. And then somewhere, you know, it looks like mid season. You know, something else got canceled, so they had these produced, and they just threw them up there. But it wouldn't make sense. I mean, I guess you could do it. Who who really cares? But they didn't put the Christmas episode, which is the last episode that was recorded or, or filmed. They didn't put that on because it would have been at the end of April. So, And you've got special feature, True Calling, Opposing Forces, Making of Featurette. There on this disc. Let's take a look. It has two discs. There is disc one. Why is the disc two? Looks really good in there. But she was always a very uh, beautiful girl. And I loved her on Buffy as Faith the Vampire Slayer. If anybody knows that, jump down with your comments for that. So that is True Calling. If you guys have never seen it, now I know it's going to sort of be anticlimactic because you're not going to get like a finale, and it's only a season plus six episodes. But having said that, I still recommend this show. Uh, it would be great if they brought it back or, you know, if they could have just at least finished it the right way. But I'm telling you guys, I know you're going to sort of want more, so why would you want to get into it? But check it out. It's only a season plus six episodes, so it won't take you that long, but it really is a great show. Uh uh, Eliza Dushku's great in it, and Jason Priestley's really great in it, and Zach Galifianakis is really great in it, so it's really a great show that I just wish would have gotten a little more love when it aired at the time. Alright, 
that's going to do it for this week. Guys, I'm going to ask you again, please subscribe, please comment, please share, and please like. All those things help the channel grow, and I can make more of these videos, and uh, that would be great. All right, True Calling, we'll be back next week with something else. But until then, guys, have a good one.